Welcome back to the Femro Pug Show. It's great to have you here. And if you're new here, my name's Charlie. I'm a certified canine leader here at FemroCanineLeaders.com. This channel is here to help you raise wonderful pups of your own and become perfect puppy parents to offer your dog a wonderful, healthy and fulfilled life. So to make sure you never miss a future video about our four-legged best friends, hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell. So then, let's get into today's video where we'll be looking at why the pug would be the perfect canine companion for you and your family. I'll be giving you the reasons in particular why you should be getting this awesome dog. It's the dog of royalty all over the world. It has a wrinkly, short muzzled face and its name means fist in Latin. I love that fact. If you were clued up on your Latin, then you would know that today we're going to be looking at the pug. The pug is hilarious. They're often referred to as the clown of the dog world, and it's because they have such a great sense of humour, and they love to be the centre of attention, and they do show off. They're what can be described as a whole lot of dog in a small space, and this is so true. They are always ready for fun and super playful, and they are highly intelligent, so whilst playing games, they're also able to hold themselves with some dignity. With some food rewards and a bucket of patience, you'll be able to teach your pug lots of new tricks. They love to do tricks, as they love the attention. I think the fun-loving lo dog is great in many homes, and if you and your family are up for some friendliness and fun with your dog, then you should get a pug. Adaptable to the environment, these dogs are super adaptable, so no matter what environment you take them into, they will adapt to it. This is great news for those of you who live in apartments, as they will be just as happy living there as they would in a house. They are so adaptable, they're also good dogs to take into the office, which could also work in your favour as they can be prone to separation anxiety. If you have the freedom and flexibility to take them with you, then there should be nothing stopping you from getting a pug. If you don't have a lot of time in your day and you can't commit to fitting in lots of dog walks, then this is ideal for a pug because they don't require much exercise at all. They're strong dogs and walk with purpose. It's worth pointing out that pugs can be prone to overheating, so whilst lots of exercise isn't required, it is essential they get it in each day. Despite the pug known to shed its hair, they are actually very easy when it comes to their grooming maintenance. They only require being brushed each day to help with the shedding, but this is actually a great bonding experience for dog and owner. If you do get a pug, it's advised that you start this grooming routine early on so that they're used to this process. Pugs were made to be compatible companion dogs and companion dogs they will be. They love the constant human attention and like some of your favourite extroverted human friends. They will not want to be left alone all day. They're known as lap dogs and are happiest when curled up next to you. Pugs are great with children and as they like the attention they're good when meeting strangers. If you're, you yourself are an extrovert this dog could be one, the one for you. They often say the owner and the dog start to look alike so maybe this should be something representative in your social life too. Pugs are incredibly loyal and I can't think of anything more wonderful than for an owner. If you require a dog best friend who doesn't leave your side, then you should get a pug. Pugs are people oriented and remain one of the most popular breeds to own around the world. They're great to have in small apartments and will be your reliable dog companion no matter where you go. Give them the attention they need and they'll be a great trusty dog to have by your side. They're incredibly funny and will be the centre of attention if you allow them to be at any gathering. I've just given you a handful of reasons as to why you should own a pug. So, what are you waiting for? So I hope you enjoyed today's video and you found it helpful. If you did, please hit that like button and to make sure you never miss a future video about our four-legged best friends, hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell because I can't wait to speak to you again on the next episode of the Fenrir Pug Show.